Hi everyone, welcome to another capsule wardrobe video. You can't tell by what I'm wearing, but it has actually been so hot here. Today just happened to be a cool rainy day. So I've actually moved into my summer capsule wardrobe for a few weeks now already. So only had my spring capsule wardrobe for a short time. I'm definitely overdue in sharing it. So let's jump right into the pieces. So first up, I have two tank tops. This one is actually a bra though, but come summertime, it moves from my underwear drawer into my closet because it has this great reversible design with a higher neckline on one side. And then with the wide band, it makes a perfect comfy crop top for summer. And then I also have this light blue basic ribbed tank. So then if you watched my most recent thrift haul, I mentioned how I wanted to have some dressier tanks in my wardrobe. So these are two of the tanks that I thrifted. This one is a long silk green one, and this is a really cute striped knit tank. So I'm very excited to wear both of these, and I think they're gonna fill exactly what I was looking for in my wardrobe. And then finally for tanks, I have this red halter top which is really hard to see what it looks like just on a hanger but this actually matches a pair of pants that i have so i love that it can be worn as a faux jumpsuit and while i love this red color i think it's so beautiful i did make a bit of a mistake with choosing this color but i'll talk more about that when i talk about the red pants so then moving on to t-shirts i have this long drapey green t-shirt and this oversized, boxy, really like washed out red t-shirt. And I've also got my Anne Muller zero waist crop tee. And finally, two more tops, this hemp puff sleeve crop top. It's so cute. And this just classic white linen button up, which is both nice and cool on its own and also great for layering. So then moving right along to bottoms, I have a pair of light wash denim shorts, which are a great length. And these kind of purplish tensile shorts, which I actually got for a trip and I'm very excited to wear again this summer. And I also have one more pair of linen shorts, which I made, but for some reason can't find. I don't know if they just got put somewhere when we moved, but I'm hoping to find them and add them to my wardrobe. Then for pants, I actually really like wearing loose, lightweight pants in summertime, not only because I burn really easily, so it's nice to have a little bit of extra protection, but sometimes the mosquitoes can get so bad here, so I find pants like this are fantastic for keeping bugs away. So I've got my plaid linen pants, and then these beautiful floral pants. I love Tamga's pants for summer. They're so lightweight and breezy. And this is another pair of Tamga's pants, which matches the top. Now I wanna talk about these pants because these were definitely a capsule wardrobe mistake, I guess you could say. I love a matching set. I think they're so versatile. I love that you can create a faux dress or jumpsuit look, but also wear them separately and mix and match. So overall, I think they're a great investment in addition to a capsule wardrobe. However, this wasn't necessarily the right set for me. I love this red color. I think it's so beautiful. However, I actually got this in the winter time and the mistake I made was not really thinking about how it would work with my summer wardrobe. And so the issue is that I have a lot of these like green tops, which I just won't wear with the red pants. It's way too Christmassy. And there still are quite a few tops I can wear these with, but just in terms of versatility, getting red pants wasn't the best option based off of just how many green tops I have. With that said though, I'm definitely gonna still wear this as a set. And I also really loved wearing these pants on our trip, like over top of my swimsuit. And if I find that I still want them to be a little bit more versatile, I might even dye them. And then I also have my pair of black leggings in my capsule wardrobe, which I actually wasn't even gonna include in the summer capsule, but then the last couple of days, the temperature just dropped. So I thought it would probably be good to have a pair of cozier leggings for just those cooler rainy days. And I also have my beautiful Tamga maxi skirt, which I got for springtime and I've absolutely loved wearing. And like I mentioned in my spring capsule, this print is exactly what I've been looking for because it has so many of the colors that are already in my wardrobe. So it's extra versatile. And moving along to dresses, I have my like purple periwinkle linen sandeflor dress. It's so flowy and beautiful for summer. And then I also have this black printed tie dress, which also has been really nice and versatile. I really like that can very easily be worn casually or dressed up a bit. And then I have two jumpsuit rompers. So this is the short one, which I talked about in my thrift haul video. And like I mentioned there, the fit isn't perfect for me. It's a little bit short in the torso. So I wanted to wear it this summer and just see 
if I actually like wearing it or if it's not very comfortable to wear. And then I also have this dark purple linen jumpsuit, which has been a staple in my spring and summer capsule wardrobes. And then moving on to layers, I also have this long printed like loose maxi robe. And this is fantastic for summer because like I said, I like to keep the sun off, keep bugs off. So this is a great, really lightweight layering piece. Fantastic for throwing over a swimsuit or putting over a tank top and shorts and immediately adding a lot of interest in the outfit. And where this red really differs in wearability from this red is that the print has a bunch of greens. It's got some light sages and some dark greens. So I can wear it with the greens in my wardrobe and it's not this obvious like red green color block that reads very Christmassy. And I've talked about this a ton of times, but it's worth saying because I think this is a great example how prints are a fantastic way to tie colors together in your wardrobe if you want to add a bunch more color. And then I've just got this long beige cardigan. This is the oldest piece in my capsule wardrobe and it is still a workhorse. And finally the navy cropped cotton cardigan that I'm wearing here. I like that I can obviously layer this or wear it just like a top like this. And again, this is perfect for a cooler rainy summer day like today. So that was a quick run through of the 24 items in my summer capsule wardrobe. I hope you enjoyed this video. I hope you guys enjoy seeing these each season and that it doesn't get boring. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in the next one.